Hello everyone, welcome to Tech and Travel. Today we have the MX Master 3 from Logitech. This award winning mouse was also recently rated as among the best computer mice for 2021. So let's look at the 7 key highlights of Logitech MX Master 3. Number 1 Design and the Ergonomics, 2 Precision Tracking, 3 The 7 Buttons and the App Specific Settings, 4 The Scroll Wheel, 5 How do you control 3 devices with this mouse, 6 Seamless flow between Windows and Mac OS and 7 Battery Life and Quick Charging. And we'll wind it all up with the pricing and our overall verdict of Logitech MX Master 3. So let's start with the design and the ergonomics of the MX Master 3 and we'll compare it with the Apple Magic Mouse as well as um, a low price Logitech Wired Mouse. So let's start discussing the ergonomics of these mouse. So you, you can place your hand here and this is what you are typically used to. Please do note you don't get any support uh, to your palms when you do so. Similarly on the Apple Magic Mouse. It's a flat mouse, it has a lot of functionalities, there are clip buttons here and here, and you can scroll through here as well. But when it comes to ergonomics, it's not really great because you have to keep your hand fairly flat. Now, let's experience what is it when you move to a Logitech Master MX3. This magical mouse is firstly ergonomic. As you can see this design, it's a very ergonomic design which means your hand fits in perfectly through this. And notice the angle, as opposed to being flat, your arm is kept this way, which is a bit more natural. And it's just extremely comfortable to use, therefore. Overall, it's pretty simple. When it comes to the design, the Logitech MX Master 3 does make your entire desktop setup look a lot more attractive. Now moving to the tracking of MX Master 3. The two things here, one on what surfaces you can use and two how precise it is. Now firstly when it comes to surfaces we have tested it everywhere, we have tested it on wood, it works beautifully, we have tested it on reflective surfaces like a whiteboard, it works well, we have tested it on glass, it works well there so overall it does very well there. And now, uh, now coming down to the uh, the dots per square inch, the DPI ratings, uh, there you can see a typical mouse is somewhere between 800 to 1000. The Apple Magic Mouse 2 is at 1300 dots per square inch. The MX Master 3 stands tall above all the others and it has 4000 dots per square inch. For a normal day-to-day -day usage mouse, this is just fantastic. It is good enough for any kind of video editing, audio editing, whatever you like. The Logitech Master MX3 has seven different buttons. Not two, not three, but seven different buttons. Firstly, the left and the right click, just as any other mouse that you would have come across. Uh, the next is the scroll wheel, uh, which is a magic wheel and we'll look at it into further detail. This scroll wheel, you can change it from line by line scrolling to free spinning. And for that, there is a mode shift button in between the one here. Next. On the side, there are, there's a back and forward button, very useful, especially when you're browsing to go back and forward, forward on the web page. Uh, so those are two additional buttons. Uh, in addition, you have a, a horizontal scroll thumb wheel, um, which is again, very useful in various situations, including in, while working on spreadsheets. And lastly, you have a gesture control button uh, right at the bottom here and uh, this helps to switch between desktop um, and, and just by pressing that and moving your mouse you can again um, have multiple actions to it. So now coming to the MagSpeed electromagnetic scroll wheel. This is clearly a big highlight of the Master MX3. This steel wheel uh, firstly is electromagnetic and secondly this wheel has been made with steel uh, and you can have that sense of 
premium quality with it. Um, now let's go and start using it a bit. Now, when it comes to using the max speed wheel on this, it is a completely magical experience. The two ways of using this scroll wheel, one, just as you would use on any other mouse, which is to simply scroll down one step at a time. The second way, once you press that additional button, is to scroll about thousand lines in one second. And, and that truly is magical. Here is our Logitech MX page, the website open on our desktop. What we're gonna do is firstly to scroll down just as one would use any other mouse. And then I press this button at the center and then you see the magic here. All right, so here is our Logitech MX Master 3. Now, as you can see, there are three different numbers here, one, two, and three. Um, if I just press this button here, um, it shows number one here, which means the mouse is connected to the first device. Now, this mouse can be connected to three different Bluetooth devices at any one point in time. And here for us, uh, we have connected ours to number one there iMac number two is our windows computer and three is the television so let me give you a demonstration of how it works here i go again now this is my mouse i'm going to press one here and now it should connect to the device one which is the iMac i'm going to put it here and yeah look at that i can i can work with everything on iMac here let me go ahead and shift to device number two i'm just pressing it again coming on to device number two here if you can see clearly it's on device number two i go back here and there you see this is now connected to my second device which is my windows machine i'm gonna go ahead and uh, now switch it to device number three yeah so i'm connecting to device number three here now so let me just turn around so now I've connected it to device number three. And as you can see, my mouse is uh, connected to the smart television here. So now here is a demonstration of how I can use just one mouse, the Logitech MX Master 3, without pressing any button whatsoever. As you can see right now, the cursor is on my iMac. Now, what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna keep moving it so let me move it to the edge ah and there it goes and there it pops up on my windows machine already and uh, here i can just i can operate both these machines without pressing the button underneath um together uh okay, let me just bring it back here is the cursor on windows ah i get it back on my imac here let me take it back again and there there you go this is all happening uh through the um, through the Logitech Flow software which is installed on both these machines. Yeah, so when it now comes to the battery, as you saw, it connects on USB-C as far as charging is concerned. The very good thing is this has high battery capacity. Uh, it can last up to 70 days on full charge. Um, and with simply one minute of USB charging, that too uh, on the port in the front, it can give you three hours of uh, good Bluetooth mouse experience. So now let's move to the overall verdict. This mouse is priced at 99 US dollars. It has seven great features that we have discussed today. Firstly, starting from the design in ergonomics really makes a huge difference as far as ergonomics are concerned. Design looks pretty sleek as well. It has good solid precision tracking. Uh, it has seven buttons and arguably one can say it has eight or nine buttons if you count all the scroll wheels there it has thousand lines in a second scroll wheel that's pretty useful most importantly it connects to three different devices uh, it could be your mac it could be your uh, pc it could be a smart television that's a big deal um, seamless flow between windows and mac i have never ever seen such experience before where one could use the same mouse across two devices 
and lastly when it comes to battery life and quick charging that's a huge tick mark uh, great battery life quick charging so all in all this is simply a fantastic product uh, and i would recommend uh, that if you are in the market looking for a good mouse simply just go ahead blindly and buy this uh, in my personal case i was gifted this mouse i wasn't aware of it as much and once i started using it i found these seven key highlights that i wanted to make sure that it goes out to everyone for more such unbiased reviews and for the latest on tech and travel subscribe to our channel tech and travel